the popular gospel chorus in Tahalia sings, There shall be showers of blessings. Rather, the reality is the fluffy rings showers blessings on the heads of the delighted children, teachers, and proprietors of private schools to mark the 2023 Children's Day celebration held in Elysia City last weekend. Good day, everyone. I'm Usman Miran. I'm here to tell you how I enjoy my Children's Day. Today. I am I am very happy so today. Lovely. It was so lovely, good, and I, I it was very fun. The Hanwha event is commemoration of the faith and plight of children worldwide, given the various issues facing their lives, survival, and future of children globally. As such, Nigerian is not an exception as the day being a Saturday makes the stakeholders organize low-key celebration to celebrate the special day of global awareness for children. The students of private schools join their public counterparts to mark this year's Children's Day celebration. Africa Edge TV was at the National Association of Proprietors of Private Schools, NAPS, event where private schools in Malaysia East local government gathered together to enjoy the day. Speaking with one of children, Miriam Osma of Donye Model School, Roboku Avenue Express and Child for the Lights being part of the special gathering. I am I am very happy so today. Lovely. It was so lovely, good, no, and I, lovely I, it dance, was very dance, fun. Dance. Why the executive of National Association of Proprietors of Private Schools, NAPS, Elisha East Local Government Chapter, gave their remarks about the celebration. So, uh... I give glory to the Almighty God for His uh, great support concerning this year, Children's Day. And I can say that comparing it with the last and last year on, uh, is, the difference is uh, clear. So, in short, we, I just appreciate God for the successfulness of the very program we have just uh, do, uh, done today. Um, to God be the glory this year, children, 2023 Children's Day, was so glorious. And we have done all glory unto God. Though in the morning rain want to disturb, but God be the glory, everything has come to pass for this year. The educationist also scored the performance of the outgoing administration on education and expressed their expectation from the incoming administration. Well, they've tried their best and to the best of their knowledge. And to the incoming administration, I pray God has helped with this on outgoing government we help them in manifold so that they will do better even the best for the educational sector especially with private schools so it is a faith i'm applied that the coming in government can do us better uh, more favor can do us better than the past i mean the parking away government the chairman of NAPS, Elisha East Local Government, Pastor Akintokun Idowu, not only scored the outgoing administration, he solicited for government loan for the private schools in order to solve their numerous challenges as private school owners. He also enjoined Nigerians to support the incoming administration, which will be led by President elect Bola Ahmed Tinubu. By giving private schools, Loan. So we'll be able to use um, as we have faced the challenges before, as I said. So if government can come to our head to give us, you know, I mean, facilities. That one in terms of monetary aspect, that one will help us to even pay, I mean, more to pay the teachers more. I mean, to, to, to add, eh, to increase their salary. So as a result of that, they will be able to, you know, to stay with us, they will be able to teach. So the major thing is that we need money. The entire management and staff of Africa Edge TV celebrates with the children.